Hey, Pastor Marvin here with you from Step of Faith Ministries. There was a deal that took place about 11 years ago um, that was sponsored by Kentucky Fried Chicken. I believe Oprah Winfrey um, partnered with them and they were giving away a free dinner, chicken dinner, for each person that printed out a voucher to reclaim that free meal at Kentucky Fried Chicken. Me being a recipient of one of those vouchers and seeing that there was no strings attached to it, I told all my all of my coworkers, hey, y'all need to print out a voucher so that you can go to Kentucky Fried Chicken and get a free meal. Not only did I tell my coworkers, but I was so excited about it that I called relatives, I called friends, I called people that were uh a long distance to find out if KFC was doing the same deal in in their state but the reason why I done that is because I wanted to share the good news of the free dinner with people that I came in contact with I ain't even gonna try to front or lie to y'all soon as I got that voucher I was at work I wasn't doing my job for the next 30 to 45 minutes. I literally became the public relation uh, coordinator with Kentucky Fried Chicken because I was calling each and every person that I knew that might be hungry or might get hungry so that I could share the good news of what Kentucky Fried Chicken was doing for the community. As I think back on that coupon, on that voucher, and how I felt about receiving that free chicken dinner, I started to think about eternal life that was given to us through Jesus Christ. And I thought about this. If I was willing to get on the phone for the next 40 five minutes after receiving my voucher for a free chicken dinner and I called each and every person that I knew all of my contacts to ensure that they knew about this deal for a free two-piece chicken dinner I just got to thinking if I feel that strong about it me being a Christian how much more should I be running through my contacts to make sure I'm sharing the gospel of Jesus Christ, which is the good news for sinners who have went astray and who, if they died, would be eternally separated from the love of God. You see, I'm not ashamed of the gospel of Jesus Christ because the power that's in that gospel change my life from the inside out. Romans chapter one, verse 16 says the following, for I am not ashamed of the gospel of Christ, for it is the power of God to salvation for everyone who believes, for the Jew first and also for the Greek. Wow, that two piece free dinner from Kentucky Fried Chicken Man, that was a good deal, especially the a couple days before payday, you know what I'm saying, when he really almost broke. So that was a tremendous deal for me looking back at it. But you know what? I know of a better deal than a two-piece chicken dinner. And that deal comes in the form of eternal life where sinners can be made righteous in the sight of God through the sacrifice and atoning work of Jesus Christ. And so I share with you today that if you are a believer, let's not be ashamed of the gospel of Christ, which has the power to change our life. Pastor Marvin with Step of Faith Ministries. Let's go and make it a great one. God bless you.